is my 1995 Subaru Sandbar that I recently converted to electric. The goal of the project was really to be a simple and low cost conversion. Um, this meant using things like a brush DC motor, uh, motor controller intended for a golf cart, and uh, a few other trade-offs like that. The vehicle has a 15.8 kilowatt hour battery. Uh, the batteries were removed out of a Ford Mustang. Uh, the motor is a brushed DC motor um, off of eBay, not entirely sure where it was originally. It's intended for 144 volts, but it's currently running at 72 volts. The motor controller is limited to about 30 kilowatts right now, and that combination with the, the motor that should be running at a higher voltage is kind of limiting the, the top end speed of the vehicle uh, with the, the gearing that's built in. The motor goes right into the existing manual transmission. The BMS for the batteries is from Thunderstruck, uh, that along with the TSM2500 charger. There's also an onboard Linux computer that is collecting data from the various devices on the, on the vehicle. Uh, there's a GPS on the roof providing speed and location data. There's a CAN connection into the BMS providing data about the uh, cells, power consumption, state of charge, and those sorts of things. Uh, and then a USB cable into the motor controller uh, with real-time stats on the motor. All those data is logged to a database so it's viewable after the fact. Um, and then there's a custom touch screen um, on the dashboard that provides a lot of this information and a map of where the vehicle is live while you're driving. All the electronics and batteries are stored in a custom-made box under the bed. The bed is on hinges so it lifts and you can easily access anything underneath it. Thanks for watching this first overview video um, of the project. If there's any specific questions you have um, or things you'd like me to go a bit more in depth on, please let me know and I hope to address those in future videos. Thanks for watching.